Skyper Sonic. My name is Giuseppe, I'm the CEO of Skyper Sonic, and this is Alok. I'm the project engineer here. So here at Rotorat, we are all about high performance, first person view drones. We love pushing the limits of these machines, and today we're pushing a new limit. I'm gonna be flying a drone that is over 1,200 miles away. So we've sent Jaboy Vortex over to Michigan to meet up with a company called Skypersonic. Skypersonic has developed a technology that allows a drone to be flown anywhere in the world from anywhere in the world. You can do remote piloting. So I'm still back here at our headquarters in Orlando, Florida, and I'm gonna fly a drone at Skypersonic's headquarters in Michigan. We used to, to send our pilots to perform inspection or to train the, the customer and user how to use the drone. Uh, and then when the pandemic arrived, we couldn't do that. So we needed to invent a platform, a software platform, able to control the drone anywhere in the world, from anywhere. All right, guys, we're down in the front room of the Rotorat headquarters, and in the corner is where we have the Rotorat SIM PC setup. That's an Apex gaming PC, so it's super powerful, and it's what we use to run liftoff and other simulators that actually run an ethernet cable all the way back to our connection point to the computer so we can not be on wireless, get the fastest connection possible. I've got my laptop set up for a Zoom call. So let's ring up Giuseppe. It's Hypersonic and see if we can actually fly a drone remotely. Yaw is yaw. All the directions seem right. So it just recognized the controller I'm using. Absolutely. Yeah. I'll set up for the Fat Shark 101 here. Okay, so okay. we got the master code. I'm gonna hit connect. Yeah, you can move. I can see the movement here as well. When I'm moving the sticks here. I see the stick here. Okay. Yeah, so you can turn on the drone. Okay. Now the monitor is gonna be show you the video from the drone. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I, I'll check in everything. You're going to fly it? So this is the live shark bite view. Yes. This is so crazy. Yeah. Now I can, uh, if you want, we can try, uh, you can fly that. Just see how you look like. I can take the control back uh, if uh, anything happens. So All I can right, try so to fly an FPV. So you're flying your drone right now, right? So it's in the, the ball. ball. Oh, let me show you the ball. Yes, bring the, the drone here. So yep. it's still five inch props. Yep. It's five inch props, but it's 14 But it's inch. in a ball. So I can He's in a ball. Out. You can. Uh, poof. We got lights. Oh man! <laughs> <laughs> the, uh, the servo on mount on it. You can uh, go up and down. You can. Do it. It's usable for inspection inside pipes okay. or whatever. Here, just give me like five degrees of up tilt or something. So uh, five degrees like this. More. So yeah, like that. Up. And now I put yeah. the drone here. And I can take off and then give you the control. Yeah. Now you have an altitude mode, so pay attention a little with the altitude because that's uh, in the remote platform. Uh, so, so do I need to center the throttle? To the center. Okay. Yeah, stay to the right. center and you can go a little up. I can, uh, if you want, I can handle the throttle for the first flight. Uh, right. If you don't want. Okay. No. Yeah. You, you yeah. Got, okay. He's a professional pilot. He's a professional pilot, right? <laughs> this is the first ever flight from Florida to Michigan. This is it. That's a moment. Three, two, one, it's yours. All right, oh my gosh, I'm flying. <laughs> I can't believe this is happening right now. What? Oh, okay, it's a little bigger than I thought. So that, bo that ball is pretty big, huh? I'm gonna go through the door. You're doing it. Ah. Moving around the fork left. Ah. This is so I nice. can see your racer, you're going yeah, fast. How, how does the lag feel? <laughs> Yeah, there's some latency, okay. Yeah. I mean, you are in Florida. I, I can't be upset about a little latency when I'm flying uh, literally across the entire country. Florida, the signal is going all the way to Europe and then, oh wow, really? Oh, the service. Yeah. Service. Our service is in Europe. You're going all the way in Lithuania and coming back in the United crazy. States. I'm I can see your racer. <laughs> <You're trying. laughs> Sky Cop the never flew right. So yeah. awesome. I mean, I gotta try the pipe, right? So I'm supposed to be able to fit in there with this giant bubble? Yeah, stay in the center. Oh. We made it! Oh. Okay. Now you get it. You know what? There's something to this bubble, guys. This bubble is pretty incre incredible. I can just- Yeah, pop. yeah, because we can bump it's everywhere. It's just like have any bump. Do you want to fly inside the, the office? Go, 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 what go. What is go. happening? Check for people. Hello, man. <laughs> this is insane. This is one of the most mind-blowing things I've ever done. 
with a drum. Oh, I just blew some of your papers. I'm sorry. Oh wait, look at this Cinewhoop shot. Look at look at this this beautiful cinematic. Oh my gosh, I just want to set up a race course. We need to do remote drone racing for sure. Yeah, that should be a good idea. Oh my gosh, it's so. <laughs> <laughs> I think the battery is going at 14.2. You have still a couple of minutes, maybe. Okay, well, I'm getting a sick orbit in. <laughs> I'm flying right now. No, you're not. I'm flying right now in Detroit. Whoa. It's so insane. This is live. This is happening. We're recording. It's all, it's happening. It's oh my God. This is the craziest it's thing I've ever done with the drone. That was insane. That was so cool. <laughs> that is cool. Oh, my mind is so exploding right now. Now we try the other drone. The racing drone? <laughs> the racing drone. I don't know. Oh my God. I'm a little nervous. The latency for navigation is fine. I mean, I was able to fly through the pipe. I was able to orbit the forklift. I was able to do everything I would need to do to do like an inspection or to explore, or if I was yeah. remotely to like clear a building or, or look for lost persons, that's all totally that's cool. the bubble. Now that I've experienced it, I'm a huge fan of the bubble. When I first saw it, I was like, I don't know about the bubble, but you absolutely need it because you, you can bounce off stuff, but it works really well, especially with the, uh, the flight control software you, you guys have because yeah. it doesn't really get yeah. disrupted at all. I think if we try to actually fly in an acro mode with that latency, uh. it's pretty challenging, but I want to see what we can do. So maybe I should probably just stay in the warehouse area away from people. Yeah, just in the warehouse area. Take into account that uh, if we move the server in the United States, we can drop the latency maybe to 25 milliseconds. That's different. Oh, wow. okay. Uh, yeah, because so, we're uh, all the way off Europe right now. Yeah, yeah but you still have to go back in Europe, come back. So it's kind of, uh, you know, double still, time. You're getting only 40. That's How much are you having latency? What's the number you were? I couldn't see because I minimized the other window. Yeah. But the, do you remember the number? About 40, 45. 45, yeah. great. Yeah, that's what we got. Yeah. We tried from here. We yeah. connected from here all the way yeah. to Europe yeah. and back. So I think what we got to make sure it works before we go to the uh, to the five inch drone is we got to make sure the goggles work. I'm just going to be unplugging my monitor. So I'm going to go blank. Yeah, yeah. I think you'll have to connect through HDMI and put that screen on. Here. This isn't actually plugged in anything. And I've just got an HDMI cable running straight from the goggles to the Rotorite computer. And now I am seeing on my goggles, everything on the computer screen. Right, I'm going to take off and give to you, right? Okay, let's do it. It's yours. Doing it. Oh, the, you know what? This really helps. I'm not gonna lie. This really makes a big difference. Like I feel, it feels way more at home to me. Oh. Zipping around. Yeah, this oh. is going to make some real good video for us. Oh. <laughs> I've never seen the drone fly so fast. I want to like get in here and do the trench run. A little lower. A little lower. Oh. There we go. Star Wars. Oh, it's happening. It's happening. Up, 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 up. There we go. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is some of the coolest technology I've ever seen in the drone space. Wait, wait, we're inspecting your... Yeah, you can inspect uh, everything. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever this is, your, um, your thing, your box. <laughs> It's right. Yeah. <laughs> Air conditioning. So with the goggles, it's much better, right? Yeah, the goggles okay. really help me feel immersed and more like, uh, like it feels more like what I'm used to. Well, let me land this and let's get our drone set up. Yeah. You got it? Okay. Oop. Rough landing. <laughs> Amazing. Wow. It's so insane. <laughs> it's so crazy, guys. <laughs> what have you done? <laughs> I want full stick control. I want to try it full acro. Let's see if we yeah. can Let's go. Let's do it. Let's, hook up let's do it. So now let's I don't need to worry because if I crash it, I'm breaking our drone, not yours. Yeah, yeah, fine. <laughs> this one, right? That's our CL1 outfitted with the uh, Shark Bite system. Yeah. So you can connect right up to your your infrastructure. Yeah, yeah. It's already already done because it's uh, completely compatible. I'm just gonna fly it. Just give him a little demo flying around without 45 milliseconds of lag and see what we can do. I'm gonna give it to you, Drew, ready? Okay, let me know when I got it. All right, one, two, three, that's you. Oh my gosh. Oh boy, <laughs> I took it back. Uh, oh, yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get you centered. Uh, point me toward the warehouse. 
Okay. All right. Let me, let me. I'm trying to go away from the people. This is going to be really difficult. All right, that's you. Okay, so I'm just going to do a little test here. I'm just going to do like a. Oh my gosh. Touch lag. Oh. Oh. <laughs> is it a little too much? We're gonna get it. Oh, let me see if I can even do it through the screen. Yeah, I don't know if you'll be able to do it because I can barely. Oh, I got it. If I can oh, do I gotta... one roll, ah, if I can oh, do yes. one roll, it's a win. I can't even do it. I don't think you're going to be able to fly. You are like, seeing that with the same leg of him. Oh, I'm, I'm seeing it with the same yeah, leg, the same leg of him. Okay, so it's going to be just as hard for me to fly as it's you. It's hard so, as you. Yeah, so you may as well just fly. I'm going to... Let me do it. Let me do it. Ready? Three, two, one, go. You are in Acro. It's very hard. I know. <laughs> oh my god yeah it's gonna be tough uh, okay new goal is i just want to take off and do a roll it's more difficult do you want to try an angle mode first nah we got this okay Ready i like it. your your positive <laughs> three two one it's go. yours okay three two one roll yeah, almost. 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 <laughs> okay. All right, the I'm timing fine. is like near impossible. So basically, I'm no, I'm gonna have to just stop the roll when I've still got about 45 degrees left to go because when I let go, I let go when it was even and it went another 45. So I just need to. I got this. I can do it. Three, two, one, roll. You let go. Oh, a little too much. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Man, yeah, it's gonna be hard. Gonna be hard. Is there some reason why it's worse on this quad, or is it really just because it's acro and you have to like? I think it's just acro, man. I don't know. It's crazy how big of a difference flying in angle mode made it. Well, I'll give it one more shot, but I don't want to break the drone. You've been really hot the last couple of times, like almost hit the ceiling on on the takeoffs. Okay. Just let you know. So I'm gonna just start lower. I just need to go up, roll, set her back down. <laughs> and just <laughs> and three, two, one, go. Oh, got it. Got it. <laughs> yes. <laughs> nice. Oh. Hey. Oh, I think. Oh, wow. That's Bro, awesome. he's the first ever in the world. We just did an acro roll from 1,200 miles away. Mind blowing. I think that's one of the coolest things I've ever done with a drone. That's just such a powerful tool. You know, I got my confidence really high being able to navigate around with the auto level mode. Really thought we were gonna be able to just rip it around acro. That proved to be very difficult, but we did end up getting the roll, which that's a huge victory. So I'm, I'm proud of that. I think what you guys have done is so impressive. This is incredible, guys. This changes this changes the drone world for sure. Well, that's going to do it for today here at Skype Sonic. Appreciate you guys. Thank you very much. It was very nice to meet you. Next time I want to see this guy flying the CO1. Yeah, that thing was <laughs> fast. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Goodbye.